so satan is called a murderer we are talking about wickedness and evil where does wickedness and evil come from he was a murderer from the beginning take note of the beginning now how many of you saw satan kill somebody or anybody in genesis you will never see satan anywhere killing anybody all through the book of genesis you won't see one account where satan came out and killed somebody what made satan a murderer was his hatred for the word of god and that hatred of satan for the word of god or the hatred that satan had against god's word was manifest firstly in adam and eve then secondly in cain so readily you will see somebody coming in to kill his brother but there was something else before the murder the root of wickedness is an opposition to the word of god when people oppose the word of god then what they exhibit is wickedness it takes wickedness predominant in the heart of a man to oppose to fight to contradict and to look for how to discredit the word of god it takes hatred it takes wickedness it takes a rejection of god's word when a man resists the truth of god that is the root of wickedness resisting the truth of god's word is the root of wickedness for example genesis chapter 3 you will see that satan moved against man sometimes you hear people say well satan was in heaven he fought with god then god threw him that it can never happen satan can never think of fighting god now why are you thinking like that satan can never think of fighting god the person that satan was jealous of was man because the word of the lord was with man that's why the moment he met adam and eve the first thing he asked them was what did god say because the word of the lord was with man and satan's hatred was for the world because it is the word of god that gives man authority and dominion on the earth and if satan can strip you of god's word he has stripped you of everything that is good and perfect the word of god that was satan's issue with adam eve and all he already rejected the word of god and he hated the word of god so the absence of god's word made him a wicked person so when he came to adam and eve he also manifested his hatred for god's word through them because they too rejected God's word. Then it progressed to Cain. Please stay with me. Remember that Satan's fall was on the earth. Satan as Lucifer started in Genesis from the beginning. Then he took a stand against the word of God. Satan and Adam fell together. They fell together. Listen carefully. I've taught that extensively in this church. The fall of Adam was the rise of Satan. Because Satan and Adam exchanged adam obeyed satan satan gave adam instruction it was that exchange that turned the angel to satan there was a twist there was an exchange of position satan and adam fell together so the issue is the word of god the truth of god is the issue man's opposition to the word of god is the root of wickedness Anywhere you find wickedness thriving, know that somebody has deliberately and intentionally rejected God's word. Man's refusal to do God's word is the beginning of wickedness. Wickedness, therefore, is man-made. Evil, therefore, is man-made. The very murder of evil is sin. The Bible says that's why God cannot be tempted with evil evil god cannot be tempted with evil